So, Michelle, this is what happens. This hi. is Brandon Creed, hi. Bruno Mars' manager. Nice to meet nice you, Brandon to meet Creed. You. Brandon, we want to just pull you in, say hi, congratulations. I mean, you. You, you guys must have been over the moon on the opening act. Amazing. We were, uh, you know, very honored to be here to, to take that slot and yeah. happy to set the night off on the right tone. So I have to ask, you know, Bruno's had obviously like number one songs on the Billboard charts, he's sold out tours, he's, you know, as successful as, as a contemporary artist can be. So does he still get nervous knowing that he's going to open the Billboard Music Awards? Uh, he, he doesn't, I wouldn't say he gets nervous, he's definitely focused and, uh, you know, they're, they're, he, he gets excited, confident and, uh, you know, gets ready to take it over. Mm -hmm. And he's one of these artists that works really hard too, obviously, but like, you know, really wants it to be like just the right way. Mm -hmm. He spends a lot of time rehearsing and preparing and directing and chore choreo doing choreography, everything. Mm -hmm. So he really, you know, and it's all him. And he's one of those artists that everyone receives very well. He really is. That's, yeah, that's great to hear. He's eclectic, yeah. he's got, he's always got something new every time he comes out on stage. Yeah. Yeah. And he does a lot of throwbacks, which we all love. Yeah, he bought, he, you know, <laughs> he, he, he takes it from the past and brings it to today and, you know, wait till you see the tour. Tell us about the yeah. tour. I was going to ask you a little, little bit about, about what, maybe uh, any, any details that you can share with uh, the fans you know, at home. Uh, I mean, it's just we're, just, we're going into rehearsals now, so mm -hmm. we'll, you know, I don't have much to share, but it's going to be, uh, it's going to be an incredible showman entertainer you know it's he's it's it's incredible probably a lot of bruno mars songs too probably yeah. a few <laughs> a few bruno mars songs yeah uh, you know i have to ask one last question when uh when i've gone to uh certain parties and i've seen he'll play like this jam set yes. that's sort of legendary for the people that have seen it yeah. he'll just like he's doing basically live mashups that mm -hmm. are mind-blowing yes. when he plays live when he actually takes it to tour does he do any of that no you know he likes to keep those for special occasions mm -hmm. and you know it, it, he figures that people are coming to see him for his songs when they're buying a concert ticket. So that's 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 what he likes to do in, on, on tour. But uh, when we do those those special performances, mm -hmm. he, 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 that's where he really borrows from the past and does the, the covers. And it's it's an incredible mashup experience. So because we're live all around the world and the fans want to know, what is it like being Bruno Mars's manager? What is your personal life like? Uh, your day to day? It's, it's, it's hectic, but it's, hectic. It's, it's amazing. I love it. You love um, it? I love, you know. I couldn't be, uh, it's a thrill to work with an artist so talented, so, you know. Fantastic. Thank Brennan. you so much. Thanks Thank so much you. for coming by. Hopefully we'll uh, be able to say hi to Bruno a little bit later tonight. Yes. yes. Awesome. Thank Thank you. Take Let's care. Bring him by. Thank you so much. Bruno Mars opened the show. He was awesome. Fantastic. Yeah. Fantastic. Brandon's one of the real good guys in the music business, too. Mm -hmm. I think I put him on the spot there a little bit. So <laughs> I'm, I'm not just bringing you uh, what's really happening here backstage. I'm also losing friends by the bucket load.